it took a few shortcuts to pull everything together, but Zero Dawn is functionally complete. When it comes to hacking, this rogue swarm is an apex predator. Anything automated you throw at it, they will hijack and take over. But this? We'd be throwing civilians into a meat grinder. Commanders, the enemy we're facing self-replicates faster than we can kill it. And it eats biomass as fuel. Zero Dawn is all we've got. So we put a railgun in the hand of every civilian strong enough to carry one, show them where the trigger is, and point them to the front? How the hell do we sell that? By giving them something to fight for. Zero Dawn. I've secured use of a decommissioned orbital launch base outside Bryce, Utah as the Zero Dawn staging area. Plenty of space there. Orbital launch base? What is that? What did these people do? What did Elizabeth do? Boy, did we get another lore drop in that last episode. There is, once again, obviously it's a main quest, so I get it. It's the way it works, right? Uh, but there is a lot going on. Project Horizon Dawn, obviously it's what Aloy's mother, or at least we're assuming is her mother. I believe it probably is, but there's also... There's some kind of time thing going on there. So how that works, I don't know. Hopefully we'll find out. I'm sure we will find out. But she, that's her plan to end the uh, the machines. Obviously that didn't happen, but she did save humanity with it. There is just so much going on. And then they mentioned an orbital station. Are we going into space? What's going on here? I have no idea what is gonna happen. Uh, but one thing that is pretty interesting, if we look at the quest and read the quest, Aloy delves the ruins of U.S. Robot Command to learn more about Project Zero Dawn. If she can discover the weapons Elizabeth Sobek used to defeat the ancient robot plague, maybe she can wield them herself. That is interesting. The wielding of the weapons. Oh, can't wait for it, but you know, <laughs> I'm usually not very good at using ancillary or secondary weapons i don't know <laughs> i've been pretty bad at that so far but if it's that important that good i think we will make an exception uh, another quick uh kind of update i did have three points and i took strike from below so hopefully we can start doing some of these now eh, if i remember to do it that's another story but <laughs> it is possible all right we need to climb up the escalator, the escape elevator. Now, if this goes anything, oh, I just noticed this. If this at all goes any way that we've been climbing recently, this could get scary. So hold on and cross your fingers. Glad to be rid of that place. Now I just need to find the orbital launch base they talked about. I've checked my data and located the base. That's the good news. And the bad? It's directly underneath the Citadel. The palace at Sunfall. The capital of the Shadow Karja. Not exactly convenient. Oh, of course. The palace is crawling with Eclipse agents. Many in positions of authority, all of them wearing focuses. The moment they see you, Hades will too. He'll issue another kill order, and this time, the entire Shadow Carja military will be after you. So, disable their focuses. You've done it before. It's not that simple. Too many focuses in one place. Each of them communicating with each other and back to Hades. A whole network of them. Network? What's that? Uh, imagine a vast, invisible web stretched across the land from end to end, connecting focuses together, allowing them to communicate over vast distances instantaneously. All right. So, is there some way to cut the web down? Hmm. Crash the network. Audacious. Yes. There is a way. A weak point in the network. Point the way. <laughs> I'll send the location data to your focus. Head there, and I'll be in touch when you're close with more directions. What was Zero Dawn? What sort of super weapon did Elizabeth make? She stopped the machines. Not before the world she knew her civilization ended. Let's hope it won't come to that again. 
All right, to curse the darkness. I did get it just in time. Aloy undertakes a dangerous mission to infiltrate a secret eclipse base and crash the cult's focus network. Now let's take a look, see where this is on the map. All right, that is, did this map kind of change? I, yeah, this is now, nah, it feels like it's more detailed, but I think, you know what I think it is? I think it was for so long we've been up here lately that that just looks kind of washed out, which is why at one point I thought that was undiscovered land territory, but no, that's the actual fog there. Man, talk about crisscrossing the map. That's exactly what we have going on here. So that makes me want to think about, uh, let's take a look at some other side quests we can do on our way back over there. Now the closest side quest, Weapons of the Lodge, we're kind of, well not holding off. Well yeah, I guess I am kind of holding off on that. So there you go, <laughs> kind of holding off on that. Um, Death from the Skies, take on the Glint Hawks. That's something that's very doable. Ancient Armory. This one we almost did a couple of episodes ago. <laughs> Good thing we uh, figured that one out. All right, Ancient Armory, that could be something. How about Aaron's? We only have the one Aaron, and this is... We just need to deliver the trophies to Asus. Asus? Cannot remember exactly how to say that. But all we have to do is deliver the trophies to that one. So we'll have to be back in Brutian for that. So I think what we're going to look at... Let's take a look at the Ancient Armory and see where this is on the map. Not exactly on the way, <laughs> but also not exactly impossible either. So that is just straight south of where we're at. All right, I guess that's, you know what? Let's do that because we have a power cell. But look at this beauty up here. I was going to say, am I going to fall off that? Back off, back off. Look at that sight to behold. Wow. And I did realize, so there's, you know, I often learn more of what the lore when I'm doing my editing. You know, it's just easier to, oh, I can't jump on that. It's just easier to pay attention sometimes. Uh, but this is um, basically arms, the tentacles of a metal devil. Is that correct? Let me know if I'm correct in that. But that's the metal devil. And that's basically metal devil. Again, let me know if I'm correct. Is the... It's how the robots are made. So there, we have the cauldrons. And then the metal devil, I believe, was referred to once as being... Oh, oh are we going to take these stairs? Maybe. As being a basically a walking cauldron. There has to be a better way down. Is there not? Oh, we could ride the wire there. Yeah, I was going to say, there has to be a better way down. Maybe. All right. I don't know what this is going to get us. <laughs> I have no idea what this is going to get us. Other than a spectacular view. I don't know if this is going to work out. This might not work out. Or it might. Easier when I was a kid. Get your slide on, Aloy. Get that slide on. Now, is this, now this is where we might be getting into some trouble here. <laughs> Oh, man. So where was that wire going, that line? It was going to take us over there, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I do not know. But as I'm trying to figure this out, friends, thank you for clicking on the video. Thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. Uh, a mess is going to be made here at the beginning. Oh, look at that health. Although it's probably not going to matter. Probably gonna end up starting all over again anyways. All right, no. I was gonna say, I don't know what's making that noise, but that is a Clinton Hawk, is it not? Yeah, you're off in the distance though. I just don't, I don't think this is gonna be a thing. But it does look like we're making it happen. Keep that for later. Nope, not later. We need it now. 
need to be heading south. Right, get out, get out. Oh, nice. Good start, good start. Or not. Oh, that glint hawk. That glint hawk has his sights. And out in the open. I think there's a couple glint hawks. Let's run. Oh, come for the help. Help me out, my friend. Oh, you know what? I need to switch over. Let's grab inventory weapons. I need the rope caster. There we go. I always forget on this for some reason. That it's not... You don't hold it to charge it. Get some damage in, Aloy. Down it went. We are getting proficient with the Glint Hawks. Oh, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Come on down. Come on down. Come on down. How is that going to be a silent strut? Is there another enemy near me? I am horrible with the aim right now. Uh, that might be, Are you really too far? No, there we go. All right, let's get that s critical. Can we not get a critical? There we go. Ain't afraid to die. Ain't afraid to kill. Definitely not afraid to kill. Dude is doing some damage. Got another shot for you. All right, are you going to come down? Come on, come on. You take care of... Oh, wait. Oh, you're an enemy, though. <laughs> oh, I have no more health. Oh, no, no. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Health. So what you're saying is just widely hitting buttons. Does not work. Down and stay down. Come on. Get that critical. Come on. Give me the critical. There we are. But I need to get it. Down it went. Where'd our friend go? Oh no. Did he not make it? It's been a while since so we've taken on some chargers. Let's see what we can do here. Need to get back. Out from behind this rock, though. That was a tremendous miss there. Oh, they're skittish also. Uh oh, spotted. Spotted, but they're running. He's down. Let's get to him. I don't even need the critical, I don't think, on this. If I can just get that, I think we're good. Yep. Got some wire there. I like that. Look at all of them just sitting there. Oh, interesting. I want to try something. Let's get a little sneaky here. Yeah, you're you're on to us though. That's the problem. I know that one's behind us, but I want to try and All right, everyone's kind of scattered. So, <laughs> it's kind of I kind of lost what I wanted to do. Who's chasing anyone directly? You are. Get it, get it. Down he went. Those grazers, I mean, look at that wire. We need that wire. So I need to 
try and do this. Alright, I guess maybe sneakiness doesn't need to happen. Oh, it's like they saw me and... It's like that one guy saw me and warned the rest of the group. Alright, that seemed to be doing absolutely nothing. That hurt it. Yeah, it did. Oh, did that actually kill it also? It did. Alright, Blaze is not necessarily a huge need. Although, I guess another update. I did, uh, in between, I did check my modifications. I also upgraded the potion pouch. I think it's the potion pouch. Oh, look at all that damage. Oh, I feel bad for this guy. <laughs> I, did. I felt bad for that guy. Oh, right there also. Help him out. He's down. Well, he'll he'll be running around. We'll be able to get to him. But look at all uh, Sparker. So again, I still need a lot of Echo Shells, which I know we're not going to get from these guys. But the wire. I mean, we just need wire. No, nothing. He just went back to work. He's like, all right. Entire family's gone. Let's go back to work. Again, I kind of feel bad. Here is a group of striders. Now, they are extremely low level. So, I'm going to try and... Yeah, not use the tear, but just our bow. And let's take these guys on. I mean, it's been a while. I mean that's actually almost kind of kind of being sneaky. <laughs> I'm ready. Believe it or not. Oh, that didn't do a whole lot of damage. Oh, missed you and got your friend behind you. <laughs> not expecting that. And there we go. Oh, he scooted. He's oh, got him from a distance. Oh, but not a, but he's not dead. Let's get him. There we go. Look at you coming from a distance, you watcher. I think there's a couple of them. Oh, well, this guy's off. He's pretty far off. So let's hold off on that. Get you. Got nothing. I see you staring me down. I see you staring me down. Oh. I actually thought he was going to get away. I mean, check out the physics. That is pretty cool. He stopped sliding down. It is pretty neat. I like it. Well done. What's making that noise, though? I think it's still one of these bodies kind of settling. Yeah, it has to be. Oh, he got me. And I missed. Oh, there's a, there are multiples. Back away, back away, Aloy, back away. Get that crit. Oh, and take some damage. Boom. Come on, bring it. Bring it. Oh, I was about to say that's all you got, but you actually were bringing some more. What do you got? What do you got? We're almost kind of back in badass mode. 
We are getting close, and we're going to have to cross this bridge. So I think now would probably be a pretty good time to maybe take these guys on. Look at all of that explosiveness. I like seeing it. Oh, we need to craft up, craft up, craft up. Yeah, we're not going to be able to make that, so let's just see if we can't take this guy out. There we go. And I saw somebody over here had very little health. Notice our health is not... Well, the health that now is fine. Um, but our storage is nothing... It's not spectacular, but it's not bad. Let's keep you at that distance up there. Let's pick up a lot of this blaze. There is a lot of blaze. And once again, we are going to be swimming in blaze. Look at it, I'm just... <laughs> All right, there we go. We finally got to the grazer. I still think there's something else back here. Yep, more shards. Uh, what did I miss? Nope, nope, did not miss. They were just another body. They were all clumped up. Love it when we take on the clumps. It makes life so much easier. Yeah, you do not have a lot of help. Oh, there's some... Oh, maybe that's why. See if we can't help them out. There we go. Down you are. Down you are. That doesn't make too much sense, but... That is what happened. Do <laughs> you guys want to talk at all? Oh, these are... Are these young Nora Braves? Yeah, young Nora Hunters. I guess that makes sense. You have to go through the... Let's go through the proving to be a brave, right? They didn't want to do any looting, though. Maybe that's one thing they'll teach them. Grab your loots. I thought I heard something splashing over here. Did we? I do need some fish parts, but that's all right. Not going to put you guys through that. All right, where did... The, oh, are we just in the general area now? Is that what's going on? Find a use for the power cell. Whoa, check it out. See, nothing to scan up here. I mean, we have that wire there. I don't know. Was there something back here? Because this is where they came from. I mean, obviously, there's not going to be anything up top there. All right. It is literally back in this general area. So, let's see what we have. Ooh. Interesting. I actually almost overlooked this. I thought this was just a little, like a little valley. I think we're going down. Uh, what's the best way to actually, ooh, other than falling, to actually get down? down here. I like the way Aloy thinks. Was this a climbing puzzle that I was actually able to figure out? Ooh, all right, we got water. Oh, can we see it from here? Oh, it's a metal flower. All right, let's grab it. There we go.
All right, Aloy. <laughs> Admittedly, this is something that could definitely be better, be better in this game, and it does look like in Forbidden West it is probably much better. The swimming is kind of uh can be pretty janky. Can I go down? Well, not really. Uh, you know what? All it is is just really ducking down, isn't it? Yeah, in Forbidden West, you can actually get down in there. But what do we have here? Oh, I foresee a puzzle. I think the old ones use numbers like this to indicate time. Secure encryption port with holographic display. Data shows required settings for nearby hollow locks. A holographic interface. Yeah, alright, so, oh, so 1200, 1500, 1800, 2100. I might be jumping the gun here a little bit, yeah, because I cannot actually do anything with those. Red light. I'm not getting in. No, we're not. Let's check. Oh, is there a window there? <laughs> Wow. I did not see the glass. I did not see that at all. All right, so, oh. What are you? From the age of the old ones. But how do I get to it? That is an excellent question, Aloy. All right, let's come back over here. Obviously, we're gonna have to do something with this, but I need to figure out Oh, examine the breakers. These devices are missing power oh. cells. I'll have to find power cells to get these to work. I think we got them. And we actually do have there. two. Fits. I just need to slide in one. There's two. It's some kind of code. There we go. So Maybe 12 o'clock. Oh. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so 12 o'clock. Is our is up? What's the zero zero zero? The fifteen. I'm afraid I'm going to turn the wrong one. Looks like each dial has four positions. Yeah, see, that doesn't really quite make sense to me. I'm just trying something around. Maybe if I get each dial in the right position. Yeah, think. Yeah, I don't know what the zeros would be, though. I mean, I guess it would be up again if, if that's what we're doing. All right, clearly that is not the answer. We need to figure this out. Um, let's see. Required settings for nearby hollow locks. Just like the last ones, I know it's as soon as I get up, I'm like, all right, why did it take me forever to figure this out? So I would think 12 o'clock would be up. I mean, 1500 is lit. Oh, 15. Yeah, right. Come on. That'd be three o'clock. 1800 is six o'clock. See what I tell you? I don't know. Something was throwing me off there. Not sure what it was, but those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. Oh, there better be. Look at that. All right, we have some data points here. We need to figure this out. Ultra weave trials. All right, so since this one is part of this, we're going to have to do this. Ultra Weave, uh, Mark 7.1 trials, trial, uh, threshold results, ballistic test. I like those high numbers. Uh, notes, Weave is not tightening properly on local impact tests. We need to optimize existing sensors or add more. Trial more, threshold results. Notes, sensor optimization successful, but torso protection still lagging. Recommend increasing wave density. Impact legs is going down, isn't it? Yeah, well, 43, then it went up to 81, down to 13. 
notes getting there on getting there on the weave density and detection components but an integration error on the left knee tanked the impact test ouch subject isn't going to be able to walk that one off surgery required i like that that's pretty good but yeah we noticed that yeah the uh the leg was going down 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 leg going down Well, do we progress? From Major Garrow to Aaron Harris. All right, so we met Harris in the last episode. You want it fast, cheap, and good, and that's where, that's what we're going to deliver. By using a flexible nanofiber weave instead of plating and enhancing protection with a 400, not sure what EV is, but hard light micro projector. We've reduced our testing cycle from weeks to days, and I'm confident we can get the suit out by next month with enough production to cover dozens of elite units at least. Better yet, it will be half the weight, half the cost, and offer twice the mobility. All we need is the balance of our funding, a few more techs, and another experienced test subject. I know resources are stretched to the breaking point, but any more delays will jeopardize the schedule, so please advise ASAP. May God be with you and Jane in these dark times. Major Semper Fi. All right, so they need they need resources, time, bodies. Echo shell. Look at eight. Love seeing that. Seven more. Beautiful. Oh, we left something behind. Health potion. All right, nothing we can do with that. All right. Um. So I need to power something up. She said. You know what? Let's go. Let's go around. Take a look at that armor head on. I, I am just getting caught up on everything in here. Experimental personal armor nanofiber construction with inlaid micro projector network. Uh, that sounds like a thing of beauty. And I see this, but can we actually go in here? Oh, we can. Oh, another. Just need to install these power cells. That should do it. Oh no, do I have I need three more power cells. They must be related to segments of a circle. Yeah, degrees. Serious, I need three more power cells. Get out, Aloy. <laughs> oh man, just when I think I'm out, they pull me back in. Let's grab those power cells. Uh -huh.